Louisiana Living on Fox 14 continues. And welcome back. I'm now joined by local author Edna Matthews here with our weekly tip to be encouraged. Edna, it's great to have you. How are you doing this week? I'm doing wonderful. Thank you, Ashley. Well, you look beautiful as well. I mean, you're the only one that can rock the over blue jean overalls and look absolutely stylish. I love your outfit, too. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Ashley. What are we talking about today? Finding that peace of mind. Oh, wonderful. That's something everybody needs, mm -hmm. and certainly I can attest to it. Finding that peace of mind, and a peace of mind is uh, that mental state of being where we're mentally and emotionally free of worry and stress. And, and, um, and so oftentimes we think that that's something that we find outside and mm -hmm. we look for outside of ourselves when in fact the only way that we can find mental uh, peace and and wellness is from within inside and so rather than so often we look for things and people and other situations to give us peace and so we're going to talk about some tips for helping to find it from within today okay. um, because um, the peace of mind is truly um, the absence of, of stress and and uh, so and our goal is to use peace of mind as an antidote just to really help to uh, give us that sense of, instead of medication so often, mm -hmm. it's that peace of mind. Um, and, and this is something that we find from within and we actually have to learn to practice it. So some tips that we're gonna talk about today is, is that you choose it. And so how do we go about choosing it? So um, the first tip that I'm gonna talk about today is simplify. And you've heard me talk about that before, but just simplify, simplify our life. Um, and we simplify our life by making decisions and sticking to them. Uh, ones that really work for you and not necessarily for the rest of the world. Um, so um, when we simplify our decisions, then what we do is we limit uh, some of the uh, emails that we take and, the, uh, and our social media pressures and all of that. And we limit uh, ourselves to uh, uh, other people's schedule mm -hmm. and and we then find ourselves finding more at easement and more appreciation for what it is that's important to you and, and another thing is is that we want to practice shortening our to-do list mm, yeah. very and we really do and we've talked about that mm -hmm. before but now as we talk about peace of mind a uh, shorten our to-do list to two or three things versus sometimes and I know I have been guilty of it I start out the day making out my to-do list with 10 things on it and we really overwhelm ourselves when really two or three things are probably the most important things of our day and that's what we want to focus on wouldn't that be amazing I need to do that I mean because I I, we have to mm -hmm. practice it actually it does not just happen we have to set that standard and simply enforce it you know and throughout the day sometimes we have to just remember the mantra is simplify mm -hmm. keep it simple just keep it simple we do not have to overwhelm ourselves and all too often we do and we become so stressed and we then build up the level of anxiety that just overflows into everything else that we do and, uh, and as I said, limiting our commitments. Um, and, and then practice our acceptance. Now sometimes we just have to practice mm -hmm. the serenity prayer which says, God give me the serenity to change the things that I can change uh, and uh, to uh, accept the things that I can't change, the uh, wisdom to know the difference and, and then just go with that. We have to just surrender, accept that there's everything, we can't do everything. And so these are some of the things that we really can help to give ourselves a better peace of mind. Edna, thank you so much. Great advice. The wisdom to know the difference. It was yes. great having you. Have a great weekend. Thank you so much. Thank you. And up next, get details on the Letterman's Club Hall of Fame ceremony at ULM just ahead on Louisiana Living.